Derby winner in the field in winning colors who seeks to stop her streak at 12. And they're up in the distaff. Goodbye, Halo. Broke well in winning colors now. And she's going to run right on the lead early. Well, on the move has come out running in third, and she's taken in hand. Integra now has been gathered back in fourth position as they head for the first turn. Personal Ensign was away in good order now. She'll be floated a bit wide going into the turn by Sham Say. Epitome is saving ground all the way on the inside. And then Classic Crown is one horse beaten, and that is Hail the Cab as they round the first turn. And the Derby winner is loose on the lead. It's winning colors now, and she's opened up by four and a half lengths. Goodbye, Halo is second, and Vasquez asking Sham Say for run now third toward the inside. Willa on the move is racing in fourth. Integra is fifth on the outside. Personal Ensign, the undefeated Philly, is now nine lengths off the lead as they continue up the backstretch. It's still winning colors, loose on the lead by two and a half. Shamse is running second. On the outside, goodbye, Hilo in striking position is third. Willa on the move is asked for more run fourth. Personal Ensign is still eight links out of it. There's a half mile to run, and winning colors doing what she did in the derby. She's still free running on the lead. Three for Longs to run, and she leads now by three. Goodbye, Halo, beginning to pick it up in second now. Shamse is third toward the rail. Personal Ensign is putting her run in on the inside now, and she takes to the outside. Five lengths off the lead of Winning Colors, who turns for home here at Churchill Downs. Stevens going to a vigorous left-handed whip, holding on by two. Goodbye, Halo is charging hard. Here comes Personal Ensign, unleashing a furious run on the outside, but it is still Winning Colors. Goodbye, Halo. Personal Ensign, a sixteenth of a mile from the wire. Winning Colors is there. Personal Ensign, a dramatic finish. Carson Lenson was facing her first defeat, but in those final 110 courageous yards, she certainly proved herself a champion this afternoon. Oh, my, the <laughs> photos will be interesting and study closely. Was it winning colors in the lead all the way, or did Personal Lenson catch the Derby winner at the wire? This is the NBC unofficial photo finish camera, and from our camera, unofficially, Personal Ensign has retired undefeated 13 in a row for this great Philly bred in Kentucky and ridden masterfully by Randy Romero. Randy Romero, what are your thoughts as you came down that final furlong? Talking to you, Randy. <laughs> Randy, your thoughts as you tried coming down the stretch, that long quarter mile stretch here at the Derby, going after the Kentucky Derby winner winning colors. What was your thoughts? Well, it's been swimming in my mind. I've always dreamed to have an undefeated horse like that. And I'm glad it's over. Do you think you won it? Yes, I did. Well, our cameras, from our angle, you did. And now it is official. Personal Ensign in, has won the distaff and maintains a brilliant, unbeaten career. Retired and will be bred to Mr. Prospector in the spring. And there she is. One of the greatest fillies of all time now. We can write that story. And what a way to go out with a courageous effort. It didn't appear that she had a chance an eighth of a mile from home. What a courageous effort, too, for winning colors on a track that does not favor speed. Randy Romero said that uh, this is the best horse that he has ever ridden, and she shows her heart today on this muddy track at Churchill Downs with a brilliant rally down the stretch to catch winning color by a nose at the wire. Let's go back to the head of the stretch. By Halo beginning to pick it up in second now. Shamse is third toward the rail. Personal Ensign is putting her run in on the inside now. She takes to the outside. Five lengths off the lead of winning colors who turns for home here at Churchill Downs. Stevens going to a vigorous left-handed whip, holding on by two. Goodbye, Halo is charging hard. Here comes Personal Ensign, unleashing a furious one on the outside, but it is still winning colors. Goodbye, Halo. Personal Ensign, a sixteenth of a mile from the wire. Winning colors is there. Personal Ensign, a dramatic finish, and here is the wire, and it is Personal Ensign there with winning colors in a photo. Very close. And it is now official. Personal Ensign 
the winner. Paid three dollars, two twenty to show, and two dollars and ten cents, five cents on your dollar to show. Winning colors at two eighty and two twenty, and goodbye Halo finishes third at two forty. Uh, exact a payoff of just under ten dollars. Dick, a magic moment, and for Ogden Phipps, you said you didn't think he was going to get there. I didn't think so. She looked, to, she looked to be in trouble. This has got to be a wonderful 13th victory for you. 13 out of 13, a man who has spent his life hoping for something like this. She, she is certainly great to me. Harvey? She, Ma oh. I have Mary Jane McGahey, the uh, trainer's wife, who cried after the race. Mary Jane, you've been, have you worked this filly? No, I've never ridden her. I, I go with her in the morning on the pony. Well, if you look there, now, I don't know about any of you. We thought she was beaten. I have Denny Phipps here. Denny, you said that McGahey handles Phillies well. How did you feel now? He handles them great. He did a wonderful job with this filly always, and uh, she's, uh, she's just been a great filly and trained by a wonderful person. In the, the, even you weren't sure of the margin of victory, were you? No, we were at an angle that we couldn't tell. Mr. We Phipps, uh, look at this move. The horse on the inside now coming to the outside and a distant fourth. That's right. She, she, I, I was scared. <laughs> they, I, I didn't think she was going to get it. Randy got into this horse, and she really started to pick him up. Yeah. Right there. She changed leads in mid-stretch. She yeah. didn't change at them the until then. Pole. At the eighth pole. Then she starts to really move. This is a very good way to go out before she goes back to Claiborne to beat a broodmare, right? Yeah. Yeah. Now you can look forward to getting the, gay, the babies. Exactly. Congratulations all around, sir. Oh, Thank you very much. Oh. Jay, thank you. And with the trainer, Shug McGahee, Bruff Scott. Harry. Yes, Shug McGahee. Many, many congratulations, Shug. What a filly. Thank you. It was a great race. I thought she was hopeless to beat the 3 8 ball, which shows what a good filly she is to be able to overcome it and win. I've, of course, not seen her before. She seems terribly, terribly brave. She is. She's a very, very good filly with a lot of courage. Well, she caught a game filly in winning colors, the Kentucky Derby winner. And it was an incredibly patient ride by Romero, who saved his filly and had enough left, just enough to catch her at the wire. What a race. Personal Ensign, 13 straight wins, retires unbeaten. And we just heard Chug say that 3 8 he thought he had no chance. What did you think? Well, I was getting a little worried, but I didn't get discouraged in my filly. I know she, she makes a hard run, and... Um... I knew from when I got to the 70 yard pole I was going to get her. She knew you'd get that, did you? At the 70 yard pole, yeah, because the other mare was getting back a little bit, and my mare, she was just keep running. She kept running, you know. And I knew I was going to get her from the 70 yard pole to the wire. It's an extraordinary thing to run 14 races undefeated. What's the secret for personal entry? She's determined. She's one, there's one in a million. You can get one like her, and she's the one. And um, what's so good about her, she don't want to get beat. She's determined to get the job done, and that's what she did today. It's been great to watch her. Thank you. And the official order of finish, Tom. Well, personal ends in showing us her courage, and it is an amazing, uh, no matter what the conditions, the Breeders' Cup always produces drama. Winning Colors had one of the great races of her life as well, and goodbye Halo, who won the Kentucky Oaks here at Churchill Downs, finishing third. You see the remainder of the order of finish in the distaff. A personal ends in one in a million, said Randy Romero. She certainly is that. Well, it's appropriate that uh, a great lady in the Commonwealth of Kentucky, former governor of Kentucky, the Honorable Martha Lane Collins, should present Ogden Phipps with a trophy, the Breeders' Cup Juvenile Championship. And that will be a filly that we won't forget and a race to be remembered often in the future. I know I'll remember it. And uh, how do you criticize perfection? A personal end, to me, has probably wrapped up Horse of the Year honors. It depends on what Ali Sheba does in the Classic, but she hasn't lost, and she certainly showed us her courage to date. Racing, by the way, for only the second time in her career outside New York on a track uh, that she may not have liked. Of course,